Hello, I'm Seth Johnson with Land the House. So about a year ago, I had the bright idea of making a dam out of concrete blocks. Well, I wised up and decided to use a flume instead. But if you'd like to read the book I wrote about building that dam, then um, please check out the link in the description below. So I have all these concrete blocks now, and what am I going to use them for? Well, I'm thinking about using these blocks as the bottom three layers, maybe even four, of my cabin in the woods. Not sure if that's a good idea or not, but I'm gonna give it a try. So the blocks were used. I got uh, 300 of them for about $100. And so I have to clean them off from all the old um, cement that's on them, the mortar. So I thought I would show you that process right now. So let's do it. So I've just been selecting a block that I want to uh, clean, setting it up over here. I've been using this sledgehammer, not really sure how heavy it is, probably a five I guess, and this old chisel, and just uh, popping off the old mortar mix, like that. Most of the time it's pretty painless, um, and a lot of these blocks are for the most part clean. These are the ones that get kind of annoying because sometimes the top doesn't quite come off like you want it to. And sometimes it does. After I've cleaned a few blocks, I grab two of them at a time and walk up here and stack them up ready to be put down on the foundation. It doesn't take long before 80 pounds gets heavy. Just been making this stack right here. Now I'm figuring that about 36 is what I need to go around the whole foundation one time. But then there's the door, so it's going to be more like uh, 32 and a half or 34 and a half, whatever it is. <laughs> but I um, have a lot more blocks to go before I can get up three or four stacks high. So back to work. So I know this is a short video, but. Um, I think I'm going to start filming small steps that I take uh, during the creation of this cabin in the woods or storage building. And so I think next we're going to take the frame apart that I use to pour the concrete. Anyway, thanks for watching this short video. I'm Seth Johnson with Landa House, and I'll see you next time. It's on there pretty good.